Hey there, movie fans. Welcome to shelf 12 and 13 of my Blu-ray collection. Yes, two shelves in one video. So, let's get started. First one is Toy Story. And here is Toy Story 2, Toy Story 3, and this is one of those short uh, Toy Story films. It's Toy Story of Terror. Uh, tracks, Trading Places, The Train, The Train Robbers with uh, John Wayne, Train to Busan, one of the best uh, zombie movies in my opinion, uh, Training Day, one of Denzel Washington's uh, best performances, without a doubt, uh, Trench, this is the, uh, the Trench Porter uh, trilogy with Jason Statham, uh, the Tree of Life. You know, I, I still like to get the uh, Criterion uh, release, which contains the uh, longer version. Uh, Tremors, Trespass, Trick or Treat, Trick Trick or Treat, not or Trick or Treat. Uh, Tricked. This is a, a Paul Verhoeven film. Trilogy of Terror, uh, the Trinity Twin Pack, you know, with the first movie, uh, they call me Trinity, and the second one is called Trinity is Still My Name. A Trip to the Moon, this is the um, <clears throat> long out of print uh, steel book. Uh, here we have Troll Hunter, Tron, the original classic, and the sequel, Tron Legacy. Tropic Thunder, one of my favorite uh, comedy films, and by the way, absolutely love this. this. This can never be made today, by the way. Uh, Troy, director's cut. And this is season one of True Detective. I recently saw season three as well, and that was that was quite good. Not as good as as this one, but uh, it's it, at least it's better than season two. Uh, the original True Grit with John Wayne and the uh, the remake by the Coen Brothers. Uh, the Truman Show. Trumbo. The Turning Point. The Trailing, uh, also known as Twin Sisters. Uh, this is um, Twin Peaks, the entire mystery. And here is the limited event series of Twin Peaks. Okay, up here we have Upgrade. And here is Twister. Two Evil Eyes. Two Lane Black Top. One of the coolest films ever made in my opinion. Really, really good one. Uh, Two Road Together, one of uh, uh, John Ford's underrated films. Tyrann T Tyrannosaur, Tr Tr I cannot I cannot pronounce this properly. Tyrannus Tyrann. Anyway, U five seven one. Under fire. Under ooh, glare. Under the skin. This is this is such a phenomenal film. Not for everyone, but I thought it was absolutely phenomenal. Uh, Underworld and Underworld Evolution. Yeah, I don't have the other ones because they, I didn't like them. I like these two though. Uh, this is the uh, the Undisputed uh, Trilogy. Uh, I still need to get part four. Uh, Unforgiven. And this is the Japanese version of Unforgiven with Ken uh, Watanabe and the Samurai version. It's pretty good. Very, no, actually it's, it's very good. Um, Universal Soldier. Unstoppable. The Untouchables. Uh, Uzumasa Limelight. V for Vendetta. This is the uh, Vacation Collection with Chevy Chase. Uh, the Valachi Papers, Valhalla Rising, and up here we have the Vengeance Trilogy. Uh, 
Valkyrie, Vamp, Vampires, Vampires Lesbos, Van God Los, uh, the uh, English title of this Dutch film is uh, God Forsaken. Uh, Vanishing Point, one of my favorite car chase films from the 1970s. Uh, Vengeance, this is a uh, spaghetti western, and this is a Johnny Toe film, also con called uh, Vengeance. Venom, a uh, very uh, underrated and, and entertaining uh, horror thriller. Uh, th this is a great uh, western, Vera Cruz with Gary Cooper and Burt Lancaster. Uh, the Verdict with Paul Newman, Vertical Limit, uh, Veteran, uh, also a very enjoyable uh, Korean uh, action comedy. Uh, Videodrome, because of this beautiful uh, set from Arrow Video. Village of the Damned, The Villainess, Vinyl. The one and only season. It's, very, it's, it's a shame that they uh, cancelled uh, the show after one season. Because it's really good. Uh, Violent Professionals. Violent Saturday. The Visitor. An Elvis classic here. Viva Las Vegas. This is the uh, digi book, by the way. Viva l'Italia. The Void, also very underrated, if you ask me. A you know, little horror sci-fi movie. I thought, I thought it was quite good. Volver. The Wailing. Wake in Fright. Uh, this is a walk among the tombstones. Up here we have Wanted, Dead or Alive, and... Warlock. Um, oh, <laughs> the other side, other side. Wall Street. Uh, Wally. Wanderers. Uh, War Horse. The Warlord. Uh, oh, this this is great. This is a uh, War of the Arrows, uh, Korean action adventure. Phenomenal film, this one, absolutely. There's a, there's a fantastic uh, uh, chase scene, you know, towards the end of the film, and and it's actually quite long. I think it's about 15, 20 minutes, and there's there's no dialogue during that scene. It's 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 brilliant. Uh, yeah, outstanding film, War of the Arrows, and this is uh, Spielberg's version of War of the Worlds. Warcraft, War Games, the Warlock uh, trilogy or collection, the Warlords, Warrior, <coughs> excuse me, the Warriors. This is the ultimate cut of Watchmen, the complete story. Uh, yeah, this is the best. Uh, version. I believe there are three versions. You know, the theatrical version, the director's cut, and the ultimate cut. And the ultimate cut, that's that's the best version of them all, in my opinion. Uh, Waterworld. Uh, Waxwork 1 and 2. Ooh. Bruce Lee uh, in The Way of the Dragon. Uh, the Way of the Gun. Um, this is Special Cop in Action, Weapons, yeah, Weapons of Dead, and The Counselor, you know, three uh, Italian crime films. Web of the Spider, Weird Science, Welcome to the Punch, this is the Werner Herzog uh, Collection, Westworld, the original film, Whatever Happened to Baby Jane, uh, What Have You Done to Your Daughters, and this is the companion piece 
What Have You Done to Solange? Great, you know, two great Italian crime films. Gialli, you know, crime films, something like that. Uh, Wheels on Mules, Jackie Chan classic. When a Stranger Calls, Where Eagles Dare. Uh, I, this, this is one of my favorite Eastwood films. I absolutely love this film. Great, um, you know, World War II action adventure. Uh, Whiplash, White Christmas, ah, lovely. White Lightning with Bird Reynolds. White Man Can't Jump. Uh, White of the Eye. White Out. Who Framed Roger Rabbit. Uh, the Wicker Man, British horror classic. The Will Be Conspiracy. And here we have Wild Arabia. The Wild Bunch. The Wild Geese. The Wild One with Brando. Here's a, a great western. Wild Rovers with William Holden, Ryan O'Neill, Carl Malden. Great western. Uh, Wild Wild West. Hey, I like it. I know it's not a very popular film, but uh, I liked it, you know, I enjoyed it. And here we have the two William Castle box set. Uh, here's the volume one. And, oh, volume two. Okay, next is Willow. The Wind Rises. Wind River. The Windmill Massacre, Wings, the complete series of The Wire, The Witch, The Witches, with a small role by Clint Eastwood there. This is a, an Italian uh, anthology film. Uh, the Witches of Eastwick. This is uh, Witness for the Prosecution, one of my favorite Billy Wilder films. Wolf. And this is uh, a Dutch film called Wolf. Uh, really good one, this one. Really, really good film. Uh, the Wolf of Wall Street. The Wolfman remake. Uh, you know, it, it's, it's okay. It's enjoyable. The Woman. The Woman in Black, which comes with the uh, lenticular slip, as you can see. Very nice. Uh, woman, whoop, oh, excuse me. Woman on the Run. And then here we have the two Ray Harryhausen box sets. Here's Volume 1 and Volume 2, The Wonderful World of Ray Harryhausen. Uh, World on a Wire, World War Z, The World's End, The Wrestler, and this is the um, Plain Archive release, which is still Shield, by the way. My number is at the bottom there, as you can see. Uh, Wired Herb, Wormwood. Uh, Australian zombie comedy. Uh, the, um, you know, the the first four X Men movies, and then we have um, First Class, uh, Days of Future Past, Apocalypse, and Logan. Right there. Extra. Very weird uh, movie. Sci-fi movie. This one. Uh, Yakuza Law. And this is a, this is a great uh, Korean film, uh, The Yellow Sea. Your next, Young Frankenstein, Young Guns, Young Guns 2, Sardos, uh, Zero Dark Thirty, and again another uh, plain archive release, which is also a uh, shield with a uh, steel book inside and here's my number for those who are interested 
Okay, and this is uh, Zodiac, Director's Cut, uh, Zombie, Lucio Filthy Classic, Zombie Holocaust, Zombie B, a Dutch horror, uh, yeah, z zombie comedy. Uh, it's also known as Kill Zombie, which is a very boring title, but uh, Zombie B is, is sound a little better. Just a little. <laughs> Uh, Zombie Flash Eaters, another, you know, same one as, as this movie. Uh, Zombie Land, Zulu, and the last one is a Dutch horror thriller called Black Water, or Zwart Water. Um, yeah. And that is it for shelf 12. Now let's go to shelf 13. Okay, here is shelf 13. As you can see, it, it's yeah, there's a lot of stuff here, but uh, not as organized as you know on the previous shelves. But anyway, starting off with that box set at the beginning over there. Uh, this is the World War II in color uh, documentary series box set, and then the brown box set at the you know next to it is uh, Conan the Barbarian. And the black one is of um, the Wolverine. So, there you go. Uh, this is Woodstock. Uh, Scarface. Uh, Pants Labyrinth. I actually did a video on this uh, set. Um, uh, Antouchable. Uh, you know, a French, beautiful French film. And this is the Roroni Kenshin uh, wooden box set. This is from uh, the Netherlands. Now here we have Marilyn Monroe box set. Uh, Avatar, that is a um, uh, Australian box set. The uh, Dirty Harry box set. Uh, Band of Brothers and the Pacific, right there, you know, tin cases. This is the coffin shaped uh, Universal Monsters, the Essential uh, collect Collection. Very nice. And then here, you know, in the middle, we have the two tin cases of Friday the 13th, uh, the Jurassic Park trilogy, the first three uh, Jurassic Park films, of course, and the Back to the Future trilogy right there. Now, this is not a, um, a Blu-ray set. This is a DVD set uh, of the Blind Dead collection. I would love to get a, a Blu-ray set of this, you know, uh, one day. Hopefully, I know that one of these films has been out on... Blu-ray, I believe, I believe it's this one, uh, Night of the Seagulls, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, it would be great if, if they also did a Blu-ray box set. Uh, the Alien Anthology uh, Blu-ray set, and this is the um, this is a DVD set as well of uh, Planet of the Apes, all of the movies and and TV series. Uh, Twisted Terror Collection, also a DVD set, and here's another DVD set of the Ed Wood box. And this is also a DVD set, uh, the Ultimate you know, Predator Collection. Uh, Close Encounters of the Third Kind, this is the uh, Blu-ray set. Uh, Alien Anthology, also a Blu-ray set, and uh, still brand new, as you can see there. And my uh, Clint Eastwood 8 movie collection there from uh, the UK. This is the um, German wooden set of Once Upon a Time in the West. Uh, Citizen Kane, Casablanca, The Goonies, Possession uh, by Solowski. This, this is an amazing film with uh, one of the best performances by a woman. Um, Isabel Ajani, you know, she is just incredible, incredible in this film. Uh, oh, this is uh, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, kind of not, you know, in between you know, the other box sets there. Uh, Lord Jim, this is from France, and then up here we have The Crusader, uh, a Danish, yeah, Danish, uh, you know, Scandinavian miniseries. The James Woods Ultimate Collector's Edition, uh, Tarantino, uh, Wanted, West Side Story, and the final one is Inception. 
And that is it for shelf 13. Now if I had done this separately, it would, it would have been a very short video, so that's why I've added this to shelf 12. But anyway, uh, I will be back with shelf 14, and that will be my Hiscock shelf. So, um, yeah, stay tuned for that, I would say. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.